Hello guys, my name is Lorenzo. In this video, I will show how to make the rapid prokaryotic genome annotation using the software Proca. And to install Proca in my computer, I will use the package Conda. There are two versions of Conda packages. Mini Conda, it's a light version, and Anaconda, it's a full version. I will click the download Anaconda and select the Linux option. To install the Linux version in my op Windows operational system, I will use the Windows subsystem for Linux. After to install the Linux version of my Windows operational system, I will use the Windows subsystem for Linux that simulates the bash of Linux in my Windows operational system. I will click the Linux version and click to download the installer. To get the subsystem for Linux, I will go to the Microsoft Store. And I will search for Ubuntu. And click to install. I already installed it my, on my computer. And I will click in open. So I have to put the package in the Windows subsystem for Linux folders. I will cut and paste into the fold Linux folders. So I will open the terminal and I will execute the bash command and proceed with the installation. Enter to continue. Press enter again. I always type yes. And now I will prepare the Bioconda channels. Here is the three channels created. So now we can install the broker with the command line conda create any broker in a bio conda on the card. It will work after I will restart my terminal. So Let's jump right in. And to install the package broker, we can type on the install the on the broker. Okay, it's done. Let's restart the terminal again. I will type conda the commands and I will type conda activate. Broker. I will type broker. It's right now. And to test the genome annotation, I will make the download uh, genome from NCBI. I will select the database from genome and the organism, microorganism. Bacillus Elisins. It's only one example. I will download the in pasta format. I will I will extract the sequence here. I will rename from genome and I convert to pasta format with dot dot pasta. 
with the pasta extension. Yes. So I will cut and paste my genome in the Linux folder. I will select the folder, the home folder. So I will start the annotation using the command line broker and put the processing power of analysis as I will put four and the prefix of my data I will put prefix you can select your specific prefix so I will specify the bacteria kingdom so in the end I will specify the name of my file so, not pasta so the analysis has started this may take a few minutes but not so much the annotation has finalized and I will show the output files created by software it's here in the paste created by the program and here are all the output files I will open one here the Excel and here are all the genes annotated and your functions so we can see that was almost 4000 TDS genes annotated and others informations from genome so that's it thanks for watching and see you again